Hello everyone and welcome to Sewing with Miss Rice. Today we are um, doing a quick video. I apologize if you see this one and the old one. The old one we had a lot of focusing issues so I just wanted to go ahead and start with over fresh. Now one thing I want to say as we start our sewing project as you will soon see is sewing isn't actually difficult. The problem is it's about a thousand tiny little easy steps and you have to just be careful as you go along. So let's go to the first part cutting out your pattern. Generally when you get a pattern, it'll be pretty simple. It'll have a couple of basic things. First, this arrow tells you which way the fabric's weave needs to be going. So if we take a look at this piece of fabric here, you'll notice that there's an edge here. We're looking for the bias which is gonna be going down this direction. So when I cut this and eventually put it to fabric, we're going to make sure that instead of going from one edge to the other of the fabric, we are instead going to make sure that it is going up and down, okay? That's the first thing. We'll go ahead and move this aside and you guys will see this as we continue our project. The next thing I wanna mention is these little arrow diamonds here. These tell you where you need to connect your fabric. When you're sewing pieces together, these little diamonds allow you to match up your fabric perfectly. So what you need to do is just with a pair of scissors, not your shear, shears are for fabric, scissors can't, are for paper. You're going to, as carefully as you can, cut across. Now, people have asked me before, okay, double diamonds, do I have to cut out that little notch or not? Um, I always tell folks that as long as you're consistent, it doesn't matter too much. Um, you can cut straight across like I did right here, or you can um, cut out the little notch. I prefer to leave it across, that way I'm less confused. And all you're doing is just cutting across the line. Now obviously with other patterns it's a little more complicated. You may have to take into consideration size, measurements, etc. Uh, we are not worrying about that in this particular video as we are just going to be making a mini pillow with a face or as I like to call it, pillow face. And there we go. Pattern is cut out and ready to go. Check out the next video where we will show you how to iron the fabric or feel free to skip and go straight to how to cut the fabric in accordance to the pattern. Happy sewing!